Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. So let us go for the next example. C limited issue rupees one lakh eight percentage debenture at a discount of equal to five percentage. The tax rate applicable to the company is equal to fifty percentage. So first of all, we have to find out I. I is again, it is eight percentage of one lakh. So eight percentage of one lakh directly become equal to how much? Eight thousand, right? Now we know how to calculate it. Then tax. Tax is equal to 0 0.5. Why? Because it's a 50 percentage. And of course, how to find that NP? NP is equal to how much was the amount of loan? Amount of loan was equal to 1 lakh, right? But this time, the company may sh issued this one. The company issued this one at discount of 5 percentage. So 1 lakh minus 5 percentage of 1 lakh. You have to calculate in this way, right? It is equal to. 1 lakh minus 5 percentage of 1 lakh become equal to how much? 5,000, right? Press the equal sign, you get something which is 95,000. 95,000. So in this example, NP equal become 95. So rest of the things are given, now you have to apply the formula. If you want to apply the formula, so KD. KD is equal to? KD, KD, yes. Is equal to? Yes. I into the tax rate. If you multiply I into this one, so 8,000 multiplied to 1 minus 0 0.5, then bracket close, then total divided by NP. NP is equal to how much? In this example, 95. Then multiply to how much? Multiply to 100, right? So press the equal sign, you will not get anything, but go for one more step. Okay, D is equal to. Let, the, let me do one thing. Let me get a sign here. Okay, fine. Now, find out this one. 8,000 into this value. If you, from, if from 1 minus 0 0.5, you get 0 0.5. 0 0.5 into, into 8,000 become equal to how much? 4,000. So 4,000 divided by 95,000. 95. Then, of course, multiply to 100, right? So press the equal sign, you get some value. It is equal to how much? This one. And this is, of course, the percentage. So in example number 3, cost of capital, or example number C, cost of capital is equal to 4.1%. Right? Yes. So if it is at premium, in this example, if it is at discount, if it is at premium, cost is less. If it is at discount, cost is more. Right? As compared to the rest of the example. So proceed the same with the next one. So let me do example number, example number, number four. Copy this one. Paste it here. Find out the value first. Find out the value of NP. Okay. Let's go first of all for the example. Delimited issue rupees two lakh, nine percentage debenture at a premium of equal to ten percentage. The flotation costs are equal to 2%. The tax rate applicable to the company is 60%. Compute cost of debt capital. It is fine, very simple, we can do it, right? First of all, we have to find out I. I is equal to 9% of 2 lakh, right? 9% of 2 lakh become equal to how much? 18,000. That become 18,000. 9% of 2 lakh become 18,000, right? Tax applicable to the company is 60%. That is it. In P is equal to how much? We have issued 2 lakh at the premium of equal to how many percentage? 10 percentage, right? So in P is equal to 2 lakh plus, plus 2 lakh into 10 percentage. Into how many percentage? 10 percentage. If you press the equal sign, you get equal to how much? 2 lakh. In the previous formula, I have made it manually, but in this case, I have made it through formula. 2 lakh plus 20, 2 lakh plus 2 lakh into 10 percentage, so it becomes 20,000. 20,000 plus 2 lakh becomes 2 lakh 20,000, right? It still, it is not over, right? From this value, you have to minus the flotation cost. What cost you have to minus? You have to minus the flotation cost. Flotation cost is equal to 2 percentage. So how can you do this one? 2 percentage of the total value. Should be calculated right so how to do this one so you have to multiply this one two percent 
2 lakh 20,000 yeah here it's out 2 lakh 20,000 or oh, let me come down NP sorry NP is equal to 2 lakh 20,000 minus minus what minus 2 lakh 20,000 into into what into 2 percentage right if you press the equal sign you get some value so the value is equal to how much two lakh, the value is equal to how much equal to two two lakh fifteen thousand six hundred so this is the value of np now you can apply the formula apply the formula you can get the value of kb cost of debt is equal to what is the formula this i is equal to how much i is equal to eighteen thousand equal to eighteen thousand multiply to 1 minus 0 0.6 bracket close and this one should be divided by 2 lakh 15600 and of course this one multiply to 100 right press the equal will not get anything it is fine now one more kd kd is equal to 18000 multiply to this one 18000 multiply to 1 minus 0 0.6, 0 0.4, bracket close, divided by 2,15,600, then multiply to 100, right? Press the equal sign, you get something. A D equal to 18,000 multiplied to 0 0.4. How much it become? Let us multiply here itself. 18,000. Multiply to 0 0.4, you get how much? Press the equal sign, you get something 7200. So the value of this part becomes 7200. 7200 divided by if 115600 multiply to 100. Press the equal sign, you get some value. So this one give a percentage, it means the cost of debt for this example is equal to 3.33 percentage. So this is called the cost of debt. So, what was the difference in example number four? In this example, we had premium as well as, of course, we had flotation. So, first we have calculated premium and then we have calculated flotation cost.